Hello and welcome. This is my attempt at recreating the Beskar staff from the Mandalorian. I started off by preparing the metal piece that I got melting down some Imperial coins. In all seriousness, I used aluminium for the blade as it is easy to work with. For the desired shape, I had to clamp the part down two times. The pattern is mirrored onto both sides. Programming was done in Fusion 360 and I am using a Haas CNC mill. The finishing passes were done with a bullnose end mill. For the roughing work I used an indexable end mill. This is the roughing process that I'll show you one time in 10 times the original speed in its entirety and the second time I'll cut it together. This was one of my first times using a 3D toolpath on a CNC mode. Therefore I was not familiar with step over values or the finishing passes. So the part turned out a bit rough but was still looking kind of cool. So I went with it. I was left with a part that needed to be removed from the remnants of its raw workpiece, so I switched over to a conventional lathe. On the left side I created a diameter to connect the part with a piece of stainless steel tube, which I will be using as the handle.
Turning the part around, the point is machined. Last up was the cutoff tool. Overall I was happy with the way the point turned out. I started in the handle by giving a 20mm stainless steel tube a nice finish with some sandpaper. I eyeballed how much I had to approximately take off from the tube to get a length comparable to that in the series. As I wanted to add some grooves into the handle, I decided on using the short part of the tube as I did not feel like ruining 2 meters of perfectly fine stainless steel, making it a ridiculously small staff. And who has the space to store a giant spear anyways? I made an end cap out of the leftover aluminum. Finally I combined all the pieces by making some indents to jam them together. Now this is the result. I would really appreciate if you would subscribe to my channel. 
as it is free and would mean a lot to me. Thanks for watching.